Hi, welcome. Today, a standing flow on your journey yoga. I'm Cheryl. Thanks so much for being here. Um, don't even have to have a mat, guys. Uh, a mat is always helpful, but don't worry about it if you don't have it. We're going to get head to toe, and let's go. So feet are hip-width apart, rolling those shoulders up and back, and just let your shoulders slide down and away. Great way to let go of tension in the neck and the shoulders. Like I said, we're going to get head to toe. Good shoulder roll up and back once again, and shoulders slide down and away. Inhale, reach it high. And as you exhale, right hand comes down, left arm reaches high, lengthen and extend. Inhale, both arms come up. And exhale, other side, lengthen and reach. Make your arms as long as you can, reaching in both directions. Inhale, both arms come up. Turn your palms to face front. Exhale, pull those elbows back and down. Squeeze through those shoulder blades, cactus arms. Inhale, reach it up. Open those arms out to a T, crossing that left arm out in front. Right hand to the tricep just below your shoulder and gently pull it in. That left shoulder down and away. And then let's turn and look out over that left shoulder. Breathe. Little tuck of your chin down towards that left collarbone. Lift your gaze, turn it back to face front. Let's take that left arm up and back, bending that left elbow, right hand to the tricep or to the elbow. We're going to shift our weight to that left or to the right foot, crossing that left foot behind, bringing those ankles crossed, bringing those thighs together as best you can. You can keep the hand on that left elbow or circle that right arm around behind, reaching up. Can you find your fingertips? Lock them if you can find them. You're welcome to use a strap if you wish. Otherwise, just keep that hand on the elbow if you can't lock the fingers and gently lean to the right. A little squeeze of those inner thighs, a little turn and looking up. If that's not great for your neck, just keep looking straight ahead. Great stretch all the way down that left side. Inhale it up nice and tall, gazing forward. Release that left foot, stand tall. Release your hands, extend left arm. And then the right, turn your palms to face front. Exhale, pull those elbows back and down. Oh, squeeze through those shoulder blades. Inhale, reach it up. And exhale, right hand down, left arm high, lean in and reach. Inhale, both arms come up. And exhale, other side, lean in and reach. Inhale, both arms come up. And exhale, open those arms out to a T. We cross that right arm out in front, left hand to the tricep, just below the elbow. Turn your palm to face back and draw that right shoulder down and away. We turn and look out over that right shoulder. A little tuck of your chin. Mm, just letting go. Lift your gaze, turn it back to face front. We take that right arm up and back, bending that right elbow, left hand to the top of the elbow or to the tricep, and gently pull. Breathe. We shift our weight to our left foot, right foot crossing behind. We bring those ankles just as tightly together as we can get them. We can keep that left hand resting on the elbow or circle that left arm around behind. Reach up. Can you find your fingertips? Lock them if you can find them. Core strong as you exhale. Give those inner thighs a little squeeze. Lean to the left and maybe take your gaze up along the inside of that right elbow. Find your breath. Slow it down. Inhaling it up nice and tall. Release your feet, standing side by side. Extend right arm up, left arm up. And as you exhale, pull those elbows back and down. Squeeze through those shoulder blades, cactus arms. Inhale, reach it up. Interlace your fingers, turn your palms to the sky. And as you exhale, lower your hands down to shoulder height. Take a big breath in. And as you exhale, press your palms forward, spine back, hollow your tummy and chest. Inhale it up nice and tall, and as you exhale, arch it back. Let those arms be as heavy as you wish, stretching through the front of the body. Inhale it up nice and tall. Once again, lower those arms down to shoulder height. As you exhale, press your palms forward, spine back, chin down. Inhale it up nice and tall, and exhale, arch it back. Again, as much or as little as you like. Inhaling it up nice and tall. Pull the hands to heart center. Let's take a giant step out with each foot, turning those toes to the outside corners of your mat. Bend the knees and sink low into goddess pose. Inhale, half lift. And exhale, sink. 
Again, inhale, half lift. And exhale, sink. Stay low in those legs. Breathe. Interlace your fingers. Press your palms out and up. Soften the shoulders. Core strong. We rise. And as you exhale, lean to the left. Long stretch all the way down that right side. Inhale it up tall. And exhale, lean to the right. Pressing through that left palm. Inhaling it up nice and tall. Pull the hands to heart center. Widen your stance just a smidge bit more. If you're like, I'm already at my widest, stay there. Bend that left knee. Sink low. Right leg stays long. Find your breath. Interlace your fingers. Press your palms out and lift that left heel. Lift the arms if that feels okay. Rise. Release your heel. Bend the right knee. Lower the arms to shoulder height. Lift that right heel. Lift the arms. And rise. If you need to put that heel down sooner, you can. And we bend. Left knee. Lower the arms. Lift your heel. Slow and steady. We lift those arms. And we rise. Again, if you need to put that heel down sooner, do. Release the heel. And bend that right knee. Lower the arms. Lift your heel. It's about control and mindful moving. Lift the arms. Where's your body in space? Press it back up. Extend that right leg. Release your heel. We have one more time each side. Bend your left knee. Lower the arms. Lift the heel. Lift those arms. Press it back to center. Release your heel. Last time on the right. We bend that right knee. Lower the arms to shoulder height. Lift your right heel. Lift those arms. And rise. Release your heels. Open those arms out to a T and let's hinge it halfway over. Stopping halfway, taking care of that lower back. We rotate to the left. Little tap of the right fingertips. How far can you rotate? Can you stack the arms? Come back through to center. And turn to the right. Little tap of those left fingertips. How far can you twist? Come back to center. Bring the hands behind the head. Elbows are wide. And rise. How'd you do? Let's do that one more time. Extend those arms out to a T. Hinge it halfway over. This time we're going to turn to the right first. Twist. Left fingertips tap. Allowing that pelvis to shift. Just rotating as far as you can twist. And then come back to center. We twist to the left. Right fingertips tap. Coming back to center. Bring the hands behind your head. Elbows are wide. And rise. Heel toe those feet in once. That takes some control. Extend those arms to the sky. Sunflowers, grand plie down. Sweep the hands down. Reach them high. Little butt squeeze. Little finger tap. Exhale, grand plie. And reach. Again, sunflower. And reach. Last one. Sunflower. And reach. Open those arms out to a T. Shift your left toes towards the top of the mat. Right heel towards the back of the mat. And bend that left knee. Sink low to warrior two. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little. And exhale, sink. Turn your palms to the sky. Lift that right arm up and over. Tap your fingertips to that left palm. Up and back. Reverse warrior. Inhale it back up to warrior two, palms to the sky. Circle that right arm up and over, tap the palm. Up and back, reverse warrior. We're going to do that one more time. Inhaling it back up, palms to the sky. Lift that right arm, tap the left palm. Up and back, and reverse warrior. Inhale, straighten that front leg, reach it back. Reverse triangle. And inhale it up nice and tall. Legs stay long. Arms open out to a T. We shift those left toes in. Right toes out. Right toes towards the top of the mat. Back heel towards the back of the mat. And bend that right knee. Sink low. Inhale, straighten that front leg a little. And exhale, sink. Inhale, straighten. And exhale, sink. Stay low. Turn your palms to the sky. Circle that left arm up and over. Tap the palm. 
up and back, reverse warrior. Inhaling it back up, palms to the sky, circle that left arm up and over, tap the palm, up and back, reverse warrior. Again, inhale it back up, palms to the sky, warrior two, left arm circles up and over, tap the palm, circle it back, reverse warrior. Oh, it feels so good. Straightening that right leg, lengthening and reaching. Reverse triangle. And inhale it back up. Arms open out to a T. Shift your right toes in. A little bit of a pigeon toed stance. If you need to shorten your stance, make it a little narrower. Heel toe those feet once more. Toes are still turned in. And we hinge it forward. Reaching down, taking a hold at the ankles. Using the strength of the arms, pull the upper body towards that space between your legs. Oh my goodness, does that feel good. You can use as much strength in those arms as you like. With those toes turned inward, a nice little stretch to the outer ankle. If for whatever reason that's not great, you can parallel your feet or turn your toes out. A little shift of your weight forward into your toes, if that's okay. And just breathe. Center your weight. Relax your arms. Slowly roll it up, one vertebra at a time. A little squeeze of the inner thighs as you roll it up. A big shoulder roll up and back, shoulders slide down and away. Shift your weight forward to the balls of your feet, turn your heels in, toes out, reach it high. And as you exhale, circle the arms around behind your back. Interlace your fingers, roll those shoulders back. As you exhale, arch it back, reach your knuckles towards the ground, lift your gaze, find your breath. Inhaling it up nice and tall, core strong, keep that pelvis tight, engaged, and lift those arms. As we keep that core strong and engaged, we keep our rib cage from popping open. Those shoulders are rolled back, chin parallel to the floor. Find your breath. Slowly bring your hands back down, release your arms, and just gently sway side to side. Just allow a heel to lift. Just twist, releasing any tension in that lower back. Letting those arms just wrap around your body. Ah, uh, just breathe. Coming back to center, heel toe your feet in to hip width apart. And we're just going to do little heel lifts. Little pulses up onto those toes. Core is strong. Just pumping through those calves, getting some blood flowing into those legs even more. Two more. And then shift your weight back to your heels. Bring your big toes to touch. Circle those arms up and overhead and sit to chair. Pull the hands to heart center. Find a focal point out in front of you. And again, those little heel pulses. We lift. We lift. We lift. So keeping the weight in the balls of the feet and the toes so that those e heels can pretty easily lift. It doesn't have to be huge. Now we've got a little momentum here. We're going to slow that momentum down and we're going to lift the heels and hold them. And little pulses with the legs. Breathe. Breaking up those blockages, allowing that energy to flow two more. And hold. Release your heels. Rock back to your heels. Weights in the heels. Toes can lift easily. We hinge it forward, straightening those legs, arms sweep back to flight, rolling those shoulders back to airplane. As you exhale, sweep it back to chair, weight shifts to the heels. As you exhale, back to airplane. Inhale, chair. Exhale, airplane. One more time, inhale, chair. Exhale to airplane. Extend those arms out to a T. Breathe. Rotate your palms to the sky. Hinge it up. Reach it high. 
Interlace your fingers at the top, all but the index finger and thumb. Rock it forward to the balls of your feet. Close your heels. Feet are side by side. As you exhale, lean to the right. Use that right hand to pull that left arm. Inhale it up tall. And exhale, lean to the left. Hips to the right. Use that left hand to pull the right arm. Inhale it up tall. Release that left hand down by your side. Right arm crosses the crown of the head. And gently pull your head to the right. Now if you can keep those feet side by side and still maintain balance, perfect. If you need to separate those feet a little bit, it's okay. Take care of yourself. Did you notice your heart rate went up a little bit with this one? Energy, those little endorphins are dancing, feeling good. Inhale, right arm lifts. Switch sides, left arm lifts, right arm comes down. Cross the crown of the head and gently pull to the left. Just let that left hand be heavy. How you doing? I hope that there's an amazing day ahead of you, or if you're towards the end of it, that you've had an incredible day. I hope you're feeling happy, healthy, and strong, present, and clear-minded. Inhale, extend that left arm. Lift the right. Open those arms out to a T, crossing those arms right on underneath the left. Bring your palms to touch. Lift your fingertips high, and as you exhale, a little arch back. Again, those feet can be narrow or a little wider. With our eagle arms spaced between those shoulder blades, a little back bend, inhaling it up nice and tall, and exhale a hinge forward, halfway over, nice flat back. You can stop before halfway. Just feeling that gentle pull in the shoulders, the strength in the core, we rise. Oh, there's those hamstrings and glutes. Circle those arms up, reach it high, and exhale, circle those arms down, crossing that left arm underneath the right, bringing the elbows to touch, palms to touch. And as you exhale, arch it back. So we just notice if there's any inconsistencies when we go from one side to the other. We're working to improve those imbalances, inhaling it up tall, and exhale a hinge forward. Again, stopping halfway or before. Breathe. Inhale, we rise. Hello, hamstrings and glutes. Big circle of those arms up and overhead. And as you exhale, pull those hands to heart center. Shift your weight to your left foot. We're going to flip those right toes underneath and just a gentle press. Rolling through the ankle, in to out, out to in. Just a few times. Keeping that weight on that left foot, kick that right heel out, bend your left knee, left hand to the top of the thigh, reach your right fingertips down towards your toes, square the pelvis. Inhale, reach that right arm out, stand tall, circle that right arm around, and once again, take a seat, bending that left knee, reaching down with the right fingertips. Again, we rise, big circle, shoulder mobility, and as we sink, a little hamstring stretch. Inhale, reach it up, and gently pull that right foot in as that right hand comes down. And we flip, left toes underneath, uh, just stretching the toes, rolling the ankle in to out, out to in. Hands can be wherever it feels right to you. We keep that weight on the right foot, left heel kicks out, gently resting. We bend the right knee, right hand to the top of the thigh, left fingertips reach down towards your toes, square the pelvis. Lengthen that left leg. Inhale, reach it out, stand tall, keep that left heel kicked out, circle that left arm around behind, and again, take a little seat, bending that right knee, keeping that left leg long. One more time, reach it out, circle it around, and once again, bending that right knee. Hamstring, mm, feels so good. Inhale, reach it high, pull that left foot back in, circle that left arm around. We pull the hands to heart center. We lift the base of the thumbs to the center of the forehead. And as you exhale, a gentle arch back. It can just lean your head back or you can have a little back bend. 
Just the gentle pressure of the thumbs against the center of your forehead, activating your intuition, inhaling it up nice and tall. We pull those hands down to heart center. We close our eyes. We focus on our breath. We take a moment thanking the mind and the body for this time on our mats, this time for self-care, this time to be present in this moment. Repeating after me, I am healthy. I am strong. I am safe. I am right here, right now. Gently open your eyes. I thank you immensely for being here with me. Take care of yourself. Be well. And until the next time, my friend, I always look forward to it. Be well. Enjoy your day. Until then, light love and namaste.